intro. I wish I had a new intro. But for now, we'll just say, oh my goodness. I'm the one who stretches not pennies, but limos. Mm -hmm. The big homie, the one and only Fax Kellerman, mm -hmm. Stephen A. Pimp, mm. James Bond's idol. Yeah. Oh, idol James Bond? Idol James Bond. The one who tells these chicks, carry on? Mm -hmm. The Don, Marquette Devon, Burton, The, the Saint. Saint. And, and the, the center. center. Giving you lessons from a pill. And several other partners. And I'm here to talk shop with you. What's going on, Marquette? <laughs> well, it's Marquette with the smooth cue, like I told you. Marquette. Uh, Quet. Yeah, there you go. Like wet. Like wet. Ooh. You done already started off and went straight in. You said you got two husbands, yes. bunch of kids. You live in Black Brady Bunch style. Thing about the young lady. I'm going to learn it as you learn it. You dig? So, Jayana, do you want to give any background or anything before we go in? No, not really. <laughs> I like how you seem like a, a sweet, civilized person, but you're really an evil feminist. I am not. Today, I'm really going to enjoy this talk because... It allows us to think about so many aspects of human life. Of course, we get to talk about these fat rascals that call themselves black women when really they're not women, they're animals. We're going to get into it. An you did. Okay. So if we have a conversation, it's no problem. But so you, who approved this for you guys? So you're talking over me again. Who approved this for you guys? You're talking over me again. You're being aggressive. I'm asking you a question. I'm asking you to you're answer You're being it. really aggressive. I don't I'm think I like you. you. I don't think I like you. We're going to, we'll, we'll head out. Okay. So okay. you went ahead and said we're not monogamous as humans. No. Well, yeah, there's, there's some truth to that. But some of the things you referenced when you said so-and-so got a, a whole family across town, Tyrone got a baby mama here, a baby mama there. Yeah, that's the men. Mm -hmm. you dig? So you're talking about now the women doing this, and that's when it becomes disgusting and problematic. But let me ask you this for real, though. If you felt like you were in an unsafe situation, would you rather have me as your security guard or would you rather have Snorflex as your security guard? I mean, you could get Snorflex knocked up, knocked out just as up. quick as her. I just want to say just that. Whoa, just side note, just side note. Check my background, shorty. I'm a CIA to the gristle. Tackle you, get you from the ground. Oh, he might. said, I didn't know who you are. Well, then why'd you make a whole two videos about me if you didn't know who I am? That's number one. Number two, he said, there are people, won't name any of them, there's people in your own genre who say don't waste your time. Nah, nigga, if it's anybody, they said, hey, act. He didn't body your fat ass. You better sit your Jamaican ass down before he make you look like a goddamn fool and end your career. Oh, and side note, he's a goon. He might pop up on you and beat your ass. You better sit down and button them lips, boy, with your fat face ass. That's probably what they told your dumb ass. Inspired me about some whole other shit I wanted to show you. But real quick, let's take another look. Notice every single goddamn photo that we've popped up, and these has all been random photos. This motherfucker's wearing a hat. So tell me I'm wrong when I say there's something wrong with this patchy head ass nigga. You got to know it's true. Two sections. I don't get you. I, let, I didn't interrupt you. I didn't interrupt you. Yeah, sure. What, what third, happens with Are BB? you interrupting me or are you? Let me talk. Why does for, natural selection. For me selection... to answer your question, you have to stop talking at some point. But yeast infection. So you're talking right now. I can't answer. Oh, beloved, you want to have a debate. Let's go. Let's keep up. Right. Which talk to me to about to why there is spermicide. We both have to be able to talk. So you have to stop talking for me to answer questions. Yes or no. Are you the guy that was under that screen name? I'm not 100 yards, but I think you pussy. God damn. What's wrong with what's wrong with these? That's when I want to say the N word with a hard R. That's when I want to say it with a hard R. You feel me? Hey, hey, real quick, ugly. Hey, ugly, tell me this. In real life, do you think that you could throw hands with me and win? In real life. You was a sweet nigga for even asking me that. No, nah, no, nah, yes or no. Yes or no. In real I life, if you pulled up ass. on me. How about that? In, right, hold on, hold on. In real life, if you pulled up on me, would I beat your ass? Nigga, never. Bro, look at your weak ass. You, Bro, how you gonna be skinny fat? Ass, you no this nigga skinny ass. fat. What kind of shit is this? Look at this nigga skinny fat with this nappy ass beard. Can we get him the same beard implant that we got academics? This ugly ass nigga. Same, hey, you little bum nigga. Let me fat. see this little box you live in. Look at this nigga. You can see his microwave in the background. This nigga live in the studio. <laughs> Yo, you can see. She fat now. <laughs> 
You see, good thing I'm swift out here. We do. Matthew, don't get, don't create a problem for yourself because you can't create a problem for me. There's no problem you can create there, for me. There's no problem. But there's an infinite number of problems I can create for you. I didn't tell you to shut up. I am not a passive aggressive what, what man. Was, what was this? I'm not a passive what, what aggressive man. That if I tell me. if I tell you to shut up, I'll just look you in your face and say, Matthew Dubenmeyer? Yes, sir. German? I'll say, Matthew Dubenmeyer, shut up. I don't have to be passive aggressive. Because if I look you in your face and tell you to shut up, what you gonna do? Nothing. Yeah. I told you we're on our way out, so just shut up and we'll leave. So what's sex with the adults? Is that what you're saying? You have to study bonobos. Honestly, when you said you got two husbands and multiple partners on the side, I'm just imagining a bunch of guys lined up and running through you like a track meet. Right, right. Like, so like you this. over here with cream pie draws and the semen can last in the vagina for five days. Yes, so semen you is very good for the vagina. You believe that it is clean to have multiple men's semen within your vagina within the same five day period? Yes, because I believe men are clean. Now, if you believe that yeah. men are with these big black ass lips, man. You didn't smoke too many fucking black and miles. Did somebody not tell your dumb ass your lips ain't be supposed to be the same color as your skin? You ugly ass nigga. Where you from, bro? I might I, not, I might know somebody in your hood to get your block knocked off. You from Philly? I'm on payroll are females because mm -hmm. females are far more competent at a lot of things, especially when it comes to details, listening, getting the job done, being on time, being reliable. That's why if you look at college, it's like 60% female, 40% male, because women are better at school. They're better at achieving. Mm. So we all know women are competent, but you so lit right now. I didn't say <laughs> one thing bad about women. No, I said something you, that's okay, real, so which you is you're physically like, weaker. No. Okay. Well, I mean, like I said, not all women, not all women. Just 99.9%. Okay. Not all. Okay. But anywho. You're fat and ratchet. Keep your That's mouth fine. closed. I can be fat and ratchet. You're fat and ratchet. Thank you need you. to practice not eating. They should right. even let you eat in here. Let me let me oh, bust you up. Security. Security. Right. Security. Don't Security. Me, Security. Oh Lord. I believe that it is extremely nasty to have a semen cocktail swimming around in your vagina with multiple men. So you think that women. men are dirty? You think semen is dirty? I just stated that, that it is nasty to have a dirty. semen cocktail men are nasty with multiple semen nasty. in your so vagina. Don't talk your husbands? Are I any of your husbands home right now? I are any of your husbands home right now? I would love I to talk to them. I think you're ready to ask a question, so let's try are it. any of your husbands home? I would love to talk to them because I cannot believe that you would speak over anyone in this kind of way and misrepresent yourself and misrepresent your family. The truth oh. is you're lying. You said it was an interview. On the title of this video, it says debate. When Bridget emailed you, it said debate five times. D-E-B-A-T-E, -E, debate. Well, <laughs> Look, see, you you don't pass the basic test. And I have this one challenge to everybody who hates on me. It's this. Don't be broke and don't be ugly. But you all are. You're all broke and ugly because you hate based on jealousy. You call me, you call me, you call she mad as hell. God damn. Lord. She I find it extremely shocking and disappointing. Do you try to teach her to improve this or are you just in the pub, the position of I'm going to deal with it and try to understand it? So I'll give a little context. Or Rakim Zeku, I'll give a little context. Is she going to over talk you, brother, or are you going to answer the question? But now he's over talking me because I just said I would give some context. And the man who's saying I, right, Kim, I just him. asked you a question, sir. Will you be answering it or will she be over talking you? I'll 100% allow my wife to add context so I can know what the hell is going on. Good. Well, I just asked you a question. Uh -huh. There is no context over needed talked by her or will you step up as a male leader and answer a man's question when he addresses you directly? As a, as a male fully in his masculine and fully in his leadership, I will purvey the situation and decide how I'm going to respond and when and from whose input I'm going to take. And so I appreciate your perspective and your opinion and the way you do things. 
But as a man, that in no way is going to dictate or influence how I respond or what I do. So your wife will dictate it then? She'll dictate nothing. I'll allow her to speak. You, you didn't allow her. She started talking over you, but go on, love. I asked, I asked her. Uh, what, is that? what is that bump on her chest? A xenomorph egg? I don't know, bro. I don't know. She was a big one. She's a real big one. And the worst thing about it is she has that big old rack. And you'd be like, okay, she got a rack, but there's just an enormous stomach under it. You dig? So if she actually was at her true weight, she wouldn't even have a rack like that. She's just so damn big. It's a pity. Do they know each other? I'm, I'm guessing. I'm guessing. Maybe they thought that. I hope they wouldn't associate me with a, a fat rascal like that. But in any case, um, if I'd have slapped her, for sure, security would have been called. Because the moment I would have slapped her, she would have started swinging at me personally. I'm not going to take that level of disrespect. I would have had to put her down. You dig? And I already had a punch ready. I was going to hit her with that, that straight right. And it was going to be stiff. Because, you know, <laughs> they all are stiff. You dig? She'd have went straight they down. Me. Then you do. Well, first off, you mean our wife since you're sharing her. And then secondly, I watched your previous interviews where it was you, her, and another fella. And she was over talking you then. Right now, I take this as a show when in actual fact, we see who the true puppet and the puppeteer is the way i perceive you right now is the type of guy who would get raped in jail or maybe even in a holding cell yeah brother you're entitled to your perception bill ask these motherfuckers about me i didn't pulled out two hundred thousand and counted it up then i didn't pulled out forty thousand euros and counted up don't pull out money because you's a broke fuck if you really had money you would give us a 360 show us how you live in in that motherfucking shoe box that you live in you broke ugly motherfucker female basketball players are great as long as they're playing other females and let's be real here. The WNBA doesn't make any money. They actually steal money from the NBA. So yeah, they don't make any money. Many they don't sell enough tickets. Women athletes don't even get paid the same. So what? That's because they're not that good. That's because they ain't that good. Baby girl, hold up. Baby girl, hold up. Have you bought a WNBA ticket? No, no. I, check this out. I, I, name, I, name two WNBA players. Here we go. Name two WNBA <laughs> players. No, 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 no. Uh -uh. no. Because well, the sad reality is that if you line up a thousand sheep, they're still all weaker that than makes one line. But the truth is that you were not ambushed. You so were standing up against scared. someone with superior logic. And in face of that logic, you started trying to over talk. You're broke. You're broke. But I want to ask you a sincere question. Just let me ask you a sincere question because I'm always curious about you guys. I want to hear you say something reasonable. Oh, you, you want to take that hat off for us? Was you about to take that hat off? You hiding something? You hiding something? You a funny guy, take, my guy. Take, I'm hilarious. That's why niggas watch me. But take your hat no, off. No, the entertainment 100. I'll give you that. I appreciate that, you ugly fuck. Sure, sure. Hey, but tell me this. Now, for you, if it's your boyfriend, that'll get you angry. And that's good because that lets me know I'm talking to the wrong girl because I want to talk to a female that's on the level. You hear me? Like, if I'm talking to a girl and I look at your boyfriend and he looks like he got fired from Starbucks or something like that, then like I shouldn't be talking to you. Cause if you were with him, that lets me know you shouldn't be with me. Thanks. I gotta assess you based on that because there's standards and everything. So if you would go that low, I don't want to deal with you because I don't believe you got a winning mentality. We at the top of the food chain out here, boy. Why do you think? Why do you think? I know why you hate me. You hate me because you hate yourself. Cause you're an underachiever. And when you look at me, you see what you could have been if you had some motherfucking hustle. You bum bastard. But tell me this. Why do you think you hate me? No, I don't hate you. I don't hate you. I just feel like you misguided and uninformed. But who? But show us how you live in to see what, what's been guiding you. See where you've been guided to. Your ass is still in the poorhouse. How are you in the poorhouse, but you got all this game? How I'm in the poorhouse and I just bought my own house. I just bought well, my Why don't you show us what it looks like?